Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome. My name is Shman and today we'll be looking at some VGC footage that I have. Now, in short, uh, I do have to say this was just the tournament that I uh, participated in. This is VGC Series 10 and I really, really, really wanted to use Seeking. So today I'll be showcasing three games uh, that we played. Uh, I played in to a grand total of 10 games, but I have to say as well, uh, some of these were not as entertaining or like I just sometimes it was a wash, but uh, I went 8-2 with this team. Uh, this is not a best of three. If it was a best of three, it could have changed quite a lot, but I just want to like showcase a bit of seeking and a bit of non-seeking. So the first uh, person we're fighting is Tassin. I know that this is the first game and I actually don't use Seeking this one. Like Reggie Lucky is being used so much right now. It's like the Pokemon that people use together with Rillaboom. Uh, so I think v Seeking certainly has a spot, but maybe not next to Kyogre. Maybe a better thing would be next to Ho-Oh, for example. Ho-Oh, I think Ho-Oh Seeking might be some untapped potential right here. Uh, the good thing, the fun thing about my team as well is that I have Encore Whimsical. Whimsical, it's a Protect Encore, Tailwind and Moonblast. Encore is honestly super great in non-Dynamax meta because normally if you get Encore you can Dynamax and just shrug it off. But Encore right now, really great. You can Encore in Fake Out for example, you can Encore in Grassy Glide, you can Encore in so many things. And as you see, Fake Out is something that people like to use. Now, of course, Incineroar can't be Encore because it is, uh, of course, a Dark type. But easily enough, I can just uh, protect, double protect with my Whimsical Kyogre. Not risking anything, just un lose a turn of rain, but also lose a turn of that grassy terrain. I don't lose anything from this. And I, I get the potential to maybe encore this real boom into fake out if it goes for it. So let's see what it does. I'm, I, also, I will try also to not uh, spoil the games themselves because uh, the games themselves are quite good, I must say. So as you see, you see fake out plus grassy glide. Now I could encore this real boom into uh, grassy glide as well because in the back I do have something that could deal with it. And that thing being, of course, Scissor and Moltres both resisting it. I could bring in Scissor, but Scissor has the issue, of course, that uh, it's in the roar, but like, he's not gonna fly a bit to Kyogre, so it's too risky. This uh, this Scissor is also pretty interesting because it is faster than most Incineroars, and with uh, Super Power, I can be sure to knock out this, uh, an Incineroar as well, if there's no Intimidate. And that's a good thing about it as well, it's just strong Super Power. We see Flare Blitz come out, I was kind of scared it was on the scissor, but it's on Whimsical, and of course, being in the rain, it takes it quite easily, and we can just move on here. Because I put up the Tailwind, I, uh, no, I've got, uh, I put up Encore. As you see, everyone gets a little bit of terrain, but as you see, my scissor is in a really good spot right now, because I can superpower the scissor pretty freely, the Rillaboom pretty much has to switch out, because with Grassy Glide, it won't knock out my Whimsical, nor me, which is really great. There we go, we see the retreat of uh, Rillaboom. I think as well that Scissor might have a spot as well. The only issue I have with Scissor really is it's not its Mega. Its Mega is so much better uh, getting KOs and being bulkier. But look at this, with Moonblast plus my superpower right here, right now, this Incineroar is gone. So there you go. I do get uh, a defense drop which is not great for my Scissor of course. Uh, with super power, like, of course, any fighting move would be better for it. Uh, it's also unfortunate it doesn't have Bug Bite, for example. But I feel like Scissor still could have a spot here. It's very niche, like a very small spot, but it's nice. Like, bu priority Bullet Punch stays nice. It's just, yeah, it's rough. It's really, really rough. And we see Reggie like it come out here. Now, I don't have Seeking with me. Seeking, also great because it just walls Reggie like he. Uh, my Seeking itself has Skulls as well, more powerful in the rain, and also like Ice Wind to make sure I could sp outspeed stuff, which is also really fun. I just go for the Protect uh, with Whimsical because I want my Whimsical alive, so I can go to Kyogre. Why to Kyogre? Uh, it's just because 
well simply said i want to be able to water spout i want to be able to water spout and be sure uh zation goose for secret sword but we tend to live on three hp and honestly i was fine with this like i would have sacked the scissor or uh lift it's both of them is really fine i don't mind i can go kyogre now i can be sure that i have my tailwind up with water spout water spout will be uh obliterating both of these mons and ta with tailwind my kyogre, kyogre outspeeds the reggie lucky and also the zation I will also be asking you guys questions throughout this video because honestly i'm just interested to know like guys what kind of teams do you like enjoy using do you want to use rain or sun maybe or uh just zation because zation is really great and of course the old classic xerneas is also there now me myself i like using everything but yeah i like uh, using everything pretty much honestly for me as long as I can put like one mon that I really like, uh, that I find will have a spot like Sea King or maybe Talonflame, like uh, that will have like a good spot that I think is like underappreciated. So yeah, as you see, I can go for Tailwind, goes for the switch into Rillaboom and the Protect, which is honestly a good play by them. I can just Water Spout. And as you see, we do about 50 to that Rillaboom. Uh, a little bit less because it's uh, a salt vest. The rain, ha however, is gone, which is unfortunate. But that means we we are able to be, uh, for example, to s sack the scissor, uh, and we could switch out the Kyogre again. But the terrain is also gone, so I could still go for the water spot. And the good thing about this music cup again, encore, it is amazingly good right now because people like to run sub zation with protect and like being able to stop that or like just protect mods is so freaking good like i can't see it enough how good that is and as you see i can go for encore making sure this zation will be useless forever if he doesn't deal with my whimsical i can always encore this thing into protect i can ice beam the reggie lucky and now uh, the little boom can come back in with a fresh terrain, which, but it's fine because I still have scissor to sack, for example, can go Kyogre again, stuff like that. Like I, and I still have my uh, Moltres as well, which is able to deal perfectly fine with the little boom. Uh, my, my Moltres is Hurricane. Honestly, I would say Air Slash might be better, but I do like it together with Kyogre, just being able to get up a strong Hurricane to be sure to that like real boom is knocked out that serena is knocked out stuff like that yeah i don't need to risk anything with my uh whatchamacallit with my moltres yet i can just safely sack my scissor off because uh, since this zation is stuck in protect and this little boom can go for fake out or even grassy light so that means i can just go scissor with its 3 hp and just let this die i can just protect with boom's as well get a little bit more terrain so I so that I might be sure that I can survive the grassy light and even a fake out. I see the grassy light coming out, of course, into the scissor slot where the Kyogre used to be. And honestly, this is looking like a wrap. I'll be real. Because like I can go Moltres, I can encore this station forever, I can tailwind plus um, water spout as well. Like I should be completely fine. I could uh, go, for example, to my what should we call it? to my uh, Kyogre to be sure that I hit my Hurricane. And honestly, I'm just gonna, because I still have the ability to do so. And the Zation needs to kill my Kyogre, if anything, because that's the only thing that can really hurt it. But at the same time, the Zation is just in a position where, yeah, as we've seen, the protecting that it has to do. So I just go Kyogre, being sure that I that I'm able to hit my uh, grassy, uh, my hurricane. Rillaboom goes for grassy glide, this time on my Kyogre slot, knocks that out. In hindsight, maybe not the best play. I could have just stayed in with my Whimsicott, be sure that I've gotten Tailwind and everything so that my Kyogre could sweep up. So I now, but this is also fine. This is just a longer term because I can now forever put Tization into this Protect. Like he will never get out of this, which is super sucky for him. But honestly, I'll be taking that. I'll be taking that. 
So yeah, I can just encore forever. That's why I think encore is super good. Really, I do. I believe encore is really good if you want to play it. I think you should. It's good. That's what. That's all I want to say, honestly. I can't like even say Bly should be fine. Like this is. It's fine. Like just encore, bro. It's good. It's really good. As you see, the, yeah, this station just has to protect. I can tailwind, uh, like, I can do taunt even to make it struggle, uh, which is also possible. But honestly, I'd rather have him be stuck in, um, in protect. Like, I should just damage this, because strong hurricanes is always nice. But I was cancelled, because he can finally see as well that he was never going to get out of that before being able to kill one of my mons. That was game one. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Let's, uh, I hope you guys enjoy the next video with VGC King.